What's up, Wayne Barron here with DarkEffects.net and we are inside of Adobe After Effects and we're going to be doing a continuance, several continuances of the lesson that I uploaded late last night and that is the uh, text effect that we see right here. In order to follow each one of these lessons, you need to do that very first lesson as I'm not going to redo that lesson, um, actually I'm not going to redo that project Instead, I'm going to build on each one of them, as in I'm going to create different projects out of that very first project. So you have to follow it. So click on the link right here. Go ahead and follow that link and uh, or follow that lesson and then come back in and jump into this one. So this is what we're going to be creating today. As you can see, it's the same effect that we had in our previous lesson, except it right here. Okay, so uh, as you can see, it uh, exploded. So that's what we're going to be doing today. All right, so let's go ahead and uh, it's really quick. Go into our emitter source, click on our text, come over here to animate, choose blur, move our indicator over to seven, create a keyframe, and then move it to eight, seven, and then come over here to nine, type in. 242. Okay, and so as you can see, our text gets blurred out and it sort of looks like it's just fading into nothing. It's a really, really cool effect. So, okay, let's come back over here to our final comp and now uh, we're going to move this down to a third so that it actually load faster for us. We're going to come right over here. You can watch as the blur starts to actually change the text as it goes along. I mean, it, it starts to get brighter. There's more white than what there was before. And then as it gets closer, it starts to expand on its brightness, becomes more vibrant. And then all of a sudden it just shatters into billions of pieces. And so it's a really cool effect, but I would definitely uh, go in and find a different type of sound audio than what I found. I mean, it was a quickie. I brought it in here and it worked for uh, what I needed it for, but we could have found something better. But anyway, the link to the sound file is free. It's down in the description. Uh, go and watch the first lesson so that you can follow through with all of the uh, lessons that's going to be coming up. The more I learn about particular, the more lessons that <laughs> that I will be creating. And so, uh, like I said, just go over y'all and get that lesson, do it. And then, uh, all right, we will see y'all in a bit. Y'all have a rocking weekend. Bye-bye.